In this video, we'll show how to set up access rights for your internal current system report users. As system reports will soon be replaced by our new report builder and its template functionality, you will need to prepare your internal users for the transition. For the new report builder, we've created separate access rights that are independent of system and custom reports. This means that you need to enable a new access right for your current system report users to use the new report builder. Imagine your organization is set up with multiple legal entities, and you want to enable legal entity admins to report on employee data and organization development. However, this should only be for people within their own legal entity. As a super admin within your account, you can create a headcount report that shows detailed headcount data for each legal entity. We have a report here, set up for this quarter, segmented by legal entity. You can review the headcount for each legal entity. This is the view for a super admin who doesn't have any restriction on access rights. To enable legal entity admins to do this also, you can go to the employee roles, open the access rights, and enable the reports access here. This access right determines which users can access the overview page, report templates, and the report builder. Next, we double check the underlying data access based on their previously configured access rights for people data. This allows for very precise and effective access control. If you scroll up and check for legal entity admins, you will likely have a similar setup here that allows them to view all people data for their own legal entity only. You will have a similar structure for salary information, attendance information, and of course, absence information. To sum up, if your roles are already configured, all you need to do is allow them the reports access. Navigate to the members area to check who is part of the role you just edited. If you visit the profile of an employee or a legal entity admin, you can log in as them to see the product exactly as they do. If they've created a headcount report for their organization, you'll notice a slightly different view. This is not due to any filter settings, but because access rights ensure they only see the headcount data of employees in their own legal entity. You can dive deeper into the exact raw data behind the headcount and export it if necessary. This is how you set up your legal entity admins or other reporting users for success when working with the new reporting interface. Of course, you can apply this example to department heads or whenever you want to restrict user access to the reporting area. Thank you for watching, and we hope you are excited about this change.